Looking at Bitcoin though, uh, the last 24 hours, we got a nice dip that if you understand the 60 day cycles, that dip was a very good buy opportunity essentially. So uh, why do I say that? Um, well, first the, the dip went all the way down here to about 55,554, almost, um, what do you call it? Uh, six fives there, uh, but we got uh, what or five fives, right? Um, but we got four in a row there. Um, but that area of price is a very good buy because we haven't yet hit a high uh, at or past day seven of the 60 day cycle. Where are we now? Currently, today is day six. The new daily candle, which just opened eight minutes ago, is day six of the 60 day cycle. We know that in all 60 day cycles except for one, we've had a high past <clears throat> day seven once we've confirmed the low is in. Um, why did we confirm this was the low? Uh, essentially, the price came down pretty heavy here. It is within the timing band of the end of a 60 day cycle. This was a mid cycle failure, essentially, uh, which was a tip of the hand that we would come back down here. Um, but since we've held up here at uh, basically the bodies of these candles, that was a good sign that we would hold the bottom of this channel. We regained support of uh, the previous previous 60 day cycle low and Bitcoin right now is attempting to come up here towards the middle of this channel uh, and basically looking to get resistance around that 60K mark potentially. But if Bitcoin can regain that $60,000 mark um, going into uh the rate uh cuts here on uh, uh, september 18th uh then that would be very good area to try to gain as support and then continue the uh upwards to test the 111 and 200 day moving average in the current 60 day cycle but um so far the high here on the 60 day cycle was on day three so we'd expect at least uh from uh basically if we hit a new high today then we should hit another new high uh the next daily candle which would be for uh what do you call it for friday so then we'd end the the week for wall street at a pretty good price overall and then we would have about uh what do you call it another uh what would that be five days or so until we get uh the uh, rate cuts 